welcome to the Upper Bloom. My name is Jennifer Tyson. Today we're going to be doing a Zen themed garden arrangement. For starters, on this arrangement, you're going to need a low stone bowl. It doesn't have to be this big. I bought this one at the Elegant Hive where I work, but any stone container that holds water that is low like this will do. So I bought these, they're called egg river rocks. Um, they're a little more expensive than your typical river rocks. I think the bag was uh, 10 or $11. If you want to use black river rocks, it's half as much. But um, I like the look of the white ones. So what I'm going to do with these is something kind of fun. We're going to create a whole runner using these rocks. I love table runners, but I like them even more when they're made out of different elements. So we're going to do one with these rocks. and. Um, you're only going to need probably one bag. So we're just going to start by dumping these out. <laughs> now that we got that out of the way. You could insert little containers right here at the bend if you want to. Now I'm not going to use any flowers in this arrangement, I'm just going to use succulents. And the succulents that I chose are just little two inch pots and what you do is just pull it out of the pot and knock off the dirt, really simple. Knock off all your dirt and then you want to rinse it off in water. So after you knock it all off, you're just going to dip it in a bucket of water just to clean it up a little bit. And then you're going to place your succulents right here into the rocks. So they kind of look like they're growing right out of them. These succulents are minimal amount of money, I think maybe $2 a piece, if that. You can find all textures and all colors in these. These are really beautiful. They have that really pretty um, coral color in the middle. Really pretty. Now, I also bought, this is called uh, Portulaca. The nickname for it is Rock Rose. This is really cool for an outdoor arrangement too. Um, these open and close actually with the sun. So you, if you're gonna use these, you wanna use them outdoors during the day. If you use them inside, they're gonna close right up. This is a type of succulent too, and they're really pretty because they have all different color blossoms on them, yellow, orange, hot pink red. So same thing, I knocked it off the dirt and we're just gonna stick them right into the rocks here. The thing I love about this is that you can reuse everything you have here. You can reuse the rocks, you can easily plant these succulents outdoors. This is the type of thing, especially these, you can practically throw these in the dirt and they'll, they'll grow. Um, they love heat, they love sun, and they don't take a lot of water at all. So you can practically ignore them and they'll just take off. Let's do one more.
Okay, now to finish this off, if you want to do something in the evening, I would recommend doing um, some of these floating candles. If you're going to do it during the day, you could float succulents too, and I'll show you how to do that. The floating candles give it a really neat effect. I'm just going to clip off one of these succulents here and just float it right in the middle. And there you have your outdoor zen tablescape. It's really gorgeous, really inexpensive. I think this whole setup, this is actually a little more money than the other ones, but like I said, you can reuse everything that you have here over and over and over again. So this costs me about $50, but it makes a really beautiful tablescape and you have plenty of rocks to go down the length of at least a six foot table. And there you have it. Thank you to Johnny Jeans for my clothes and my jewelry. Again, she's in Old Town Tustin, and her boutique was voted fourth hottest in Orange County. And thanks again to Anna Brandt for my beautiful backdrop.